<laughs> I got all confused, and then I got scared, and then I, and then I settled into it a little bit. I was just a little drunk. Okay. Technical difficulty subsided. There are now two options as to what has just happened. Either you saw me start this quest, and then you heard the intro, and now I'm being redundant, or... Uh, you need me to surmise that I started a quest for Gareth Weasley to go steal some candy ingredients, and I didn't I say no because Larry's afraid of not making friends. That's our in-world explanation. This feels... I knew it. Gamer Instinct for the win, except all this goddamn equipment is fucking under-leveled. I hate that. I hate that for me. <laughs> I want cool stuff, but instead I just keep getting witch hats that look dumb, and then they're under-leveled, and I just don't care. I hate that for me. <laughs> la -da -da. La -da -da. La -da -da. Okay, okay, we're back on track. We're focused. We're blazing forward. Why is there Something a passage? Something sweet. Must be close to Honeydukes. My only real question is just like, why on God's green earth is there a connection from a random corridor in Hogwarts to the candy shop in Hogsmeade? Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Yes. They do. You say this quite often, Larry, and I guess you're technically very correct. Chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? Indeed. Maybe now. Let's do this. This feels appropriate. And then we'll look at a wardrobe change. Since I just picked up a bunch of stuff, maybe some of it at least looks good. But we'll see. We will see. I have the dried billywigs things. Now back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. Oh, okay. Cool, so there really is no need. Wow, that was so fast. I, I mean, I know I just said it a little while ago, but really, some of these side quests really, like, wrap up super quickly. I'm sure something terrible is about to happen. Like, I haven't fought anything during this encounter. I've literally just run up and down a hallway. But I guess I could have fast-traveled, so there's no technical need for me to be... And I died. Um, I didn't. I just swam. That's fine. This will be faster anyway. Hehehe. <laughs> Jogging. There's no P class at Hogwarts because they know you're just going to be running around pulling off shenanigans the entire time. They're like, we know who our students are. We're not dumb. We can fit in an extra academia, academic class. Give you more academia. We don't need a physical education course. You're just going to be running around the English countryside causing mass havoc and all the muggles are going to be confused. I mean, why not? Use that time. They ain't dumb people. These whiz -harrods. Hello again. Were you able to get to Honey Dukes? That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. I heard him talking about taking responsibility. Professor Sharp was annoyed, but we sorted it out. No harm. Cheers to that. He probably had a good chuckle after we left. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise, fewer explosions. 
There's no being off. I, I just realized I didn't exhaust my dialogue options with you before. Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywigs things. You got them. Incredible. <laughs> Happy to help. Here you go. This is brilliant. Can't wait to get started. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. So, all of the all the negative dialogue options that I've seen, like, and there's no mor morality system in this, as far as I know. I haven't gotten to anything where it makes a difference, but I don't remember hearing anything that um, that a morality system is really in place. It's just kind of you role playing your character, which is totally great. That's totally fine. Um, I love that. But the funny thing to me about it is just that like all of the negative options really seem to just be like you being kind of a jackass. Like it's not, it's not you. Oh yes. We're going to wear this. It's not you like being mean or evil or self-righteous it's it's just you kind of being like the most annoying student which is really kind of funny to me Ooh, that doesn't really look good if we don't have any gloves on what kind of gloves oh looking good larry looking good suppose wait we should see what else we've got in store for ourselves the dialing keys yeah i need to do this i still need to dodge like three things so let's see if oh i don't have the right i don't it's locked so i got to keep doing other stuff so we'll do that sure why not I guess we're gonna go exploring. This episode could be full of quick cuts. You don't know. You gotta wait around and see. Excuse me? Could you shut the fuck up? Oh. Wait, wait, wait. I see bridge. I got money. We're going to see how horrendously dangerous and a bad idea this is. Regular chickens. Okay. I feel like... Wait, 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 wait. Give me your experience! Wow, like, kid, they're... Kill stuff's not really worth a lot of experience. It's like... Doing all side quests, now that's worth some experience. So happy to do that. I'm glad I don't have a normal job. I'm happy with my life just the way it is. What about curse breakers? I thought I wanted to be one. Wait, 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 wait. Spiders? Okay. Yeah, we'll do this, we'll do this, we'll do this. Gaining some experience. There's like people in these webs. I'm being a hero. Ooh, no. We are not being a good hero, though. Okay, we did it. We need to. Nope, no, 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 no. Can I, can I save that man? Or is he just doomed for all eternity? My apathy to your situation, sir, has been forced upon me. It has nothing to do with how I actually feel 
Incendio. About saving you. Oh, cool. I assumed that that was going to be a big set piece and that... I wasn't going to be able to do anything about it, but it's dead. Doing magic. Doing combos. My wants on recharge. Doing magic. Doing combos. There it is. Oh. Beat a challenge. Don't know what that necessarily does for me. Oh, no, I do. I mean, like, awards, but that specific challenge, I don't know. Ooh, there's something on the map. How is there still one more spider? I really thought, like, I thought that I... So, do I gotta get rid of all the webs, and then that completely gets rid of them, or... No, it's on him. Oh! Okay. I saved you. You let Norris Bagwell go, didn't you? You're about to wish you had a What? Okay, fine. You're welcome for saving your life. I get it, you're a bad guy. Jeez. Real black and white approach to the world, my friend. Extreme danger. Sweet. But there's like a bunch of red squirrels. How bad can it be? Squirrels and rabbits. They're like the two most fragile prey animals in the world. I'm not really too afraid if squirrels and rabbits are bounding about. Seems like a pretty... Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Sweet. I like Let things abandoned. Show. I like things abandoned long ago. Accio. I have a feeling I don't have what I need to do this yet. Incendio. That did that. kind of enemy is around here? I see you on my map. But I don't see you with my eyes. My very special eyes. You're gonna regret coming here. I'd huh? my own father if there were galleons in it. Not my mother, mind. Okay, sweet. I know what we'll do to finish off this episode. Get hit by a rock! Jerk. Jackknobs. Jackanapes. Being ass hats in the woods. I wanted to get that flu flame. Just to have it out of the way. That's gonna hurt. Okay, it didn't hurt. Ooh, this seems like a bad idea. This is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. That's too many levels. That's too many levels. We're gonna continue on in the direction I was going before. Run away, Larry, run away. Is that treasure? No, it's another one of these. That's exactly. not what I meant. That's what I meant. I guess I don't understand the purpose of lighting those as of yet, but tis not mine to wonder why. Incendio. 
Okay, that d seems to do it in one go. Thank you all. I should take a peek at that actual map again if I really want to find it. But all that matters is this beautiful view and the fact that I found a cool coat. What else could a man possibly want? Looks rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. Incendio! Yeah, but how does one get in? Like, I love finding all these things. But probably for... quest, but there's a tent. I should really look at this treasure map. Oh, it's a Merlin trial. And money. Not much money, but Let's money. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. I may not have the spells for this. I don't think I have the spell for this. I have wandered too close to the sun, some might say. Who's down here? Well, I mean that was kind of not what I wanted. I didn't want to, I didn't want the one that was already like I gotta use stupefy more. It's literal counter. I love counter moves. I'm not doing anything about it. Apparently I don't get to have that experience. It's gonna live there forever. Okay, let's take a peek at this map. Forest, bridge, candles. And you gotta light the candles, I'm presuming. That's what that means. And we have no idea particularly where that could happen. Well, let's go back to Hecate then. Get another spell. And that will possibly really, uh, maybe help us out. At least in a little exploration. Teach me stuff. Everything I had asked. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Boom. You mean like that? Where is it? There is it. You wish to stay in practice? Expelliarmus, you seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life. Cool. Okay. Done and done. So I guess 
without really knowing where that map is, and we might as well. Go wander around in the Forbidden Forest. What is this? Small bandit cab. Well, we'll just, uh... Don't mind me. <laughs> the allure of treasure is my weakness. Actually, cheesecake is my weakness. Oh my god, the flowers. They're still there. Now we're going to this bandit camp, Larry. I want... I want... Like, I do want... I do want Expelliarmus. But for now... Because I think that I can sneak. Yeah, there's treasure and the ability to sneak. So let's go ahead and see about using these stealth spells, maybe. Poachers, anyway. Who cares? When the clouds are... Oh, crap. No, no, no. That's not good. Pardon me. Enemies nearby, but um, I need to take a trip. And then we'll be back. No, 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 not what I meant, not what I meant. Oopsie poopsie. My bad, I got too much crap on my person. that one. Oh, and I also Come like didn't walk back here ever and no just like take your money. You My gears Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. All of this stuff I don't care about. Oh wait. I care about those. I you have a sharp eye for that. We will not be wearing them, however, because they look like the dumbest things I've ever seen. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. I start customizing gear with like traits and stuff. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Cool. You can immediately Plenty buy this robe that today. I stole from you back. Your time. Cool, thanks. What? Oh. There's really good stuff. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Locked. Yeah, maybe locked, but I'm about to get there. So this... You won't be disappointed. That's a glad rat's promise. We're gonna take a bunch of that stuff. Cause it'll be good in a minute. I 
I actually don't even necessarily hate that scarf. Oh, fashion choice is so very, very difficult. It's locked. Yep. This one's not, though. My goodness. Excuse me. Oh my goodness. Wow. What an adventurer. Well, since we're going on an adventure, I suppose... We're gonna get back to Plenty it. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Made a bunch of money. I expect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by. Okay. treasure vault that's what we're doing and then i'll go to do the quest because i don't care about story i do care about story i swear okay oh my god every time i go to this one those freaking farting horn flowers are there to greet me okay Larry's got a better handle on an actual adventurer's uniform than we did in that one episode. And now we can successfully Metal Gear Gryffindor our way through this. Free experience, essentially. Oh no, my friend is down. Too bad I'm dead. <laughs> Jake. Give me your stuff. Cool. So now I have a charm to add to something, but how does one do that? Doesn't matter. We're going to the treasure vault. Get some moonstone. And some mushrooms. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. So we'll be careful. Don't be such a spoil sport. Um. Dive. Is it this easy? Nope. Cool. Oh, it is this easy. Why was it this easy? I don't even worth it. Ugh. Ugh. Just crappy gloves. 
That's all that was hidden in your special little cave? Okay. Well, not to be utterly disappointing, but that's going to wrap it up for this episode. So if there's anybody out there watching or listening, uh, thank you for being here. I'm really glad that you're here, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>